Hi guys, Ryan here. So I have a Gravity Rush slash Gravity Days. You can call it either one, but um, known in the US it's called Gravity Rush. I have a Figma figure of Raven. So, let's take off the bubble wrap that this was in. It was packaged very well. I got this new off um, Mercari, the selling slash buying app. So yeah, there is Raven. This is Figma number 345 from Gravity Rush 2 or Gravity Days 2. This is done by Max Factory. And I love the, the red, black kind of colors that match Raven's hair very well. So there's the top of the box. Here's a close-up view of the front. And then we have the side view here, side profile, but yeah, looks fantastic for sure, without a doubt. So there is the back with all the different poses and stuff, and this comes with a Figma stand, which is very nice. And then we have the side view with her in the mask that she wears in Gravity Rush 2, the video game. So yeah, I'm going to cut the tape and we're going to unbox this and check out this figure. Alright, so I got that off, now I can take the figure out of the box for the very first time. Alright, so there is the figure inside the plastic covering. So I'm just gonna take it out. All right, and I love Figma figures. I think they're fantastic. This has, there we go. So this has a Figma stand that can clamp onto the table. And this also, the other figure from Gravity Rush of Cat, the main character, the protagonist, that figure also comes with a clamp. So, yeah. So that's very nice to have. Just gonna put that there. All right, so it's time to take out this character. Okay, I was wondering where the hands were. They were inside here. So yeah, we have the instructions. We also have a bag to put everything in. So I'm just going to cut this open. So this comes with a tiny piece to, um, it basically connects the hand to the arm. So that is good having that little piece. And then we have the set of hands here. And then we also have the base of the stand. And then the arm of the stand as well. So there that is. So yeah, it looks like you can just kind of put this right through there, connected to the clamping stand. And then you can connect it into the back of the figure because there's a hole in the back of the figure. So yeah, still in the wrapping and everything. Glad I found this new. These Figures are always going up in price because they're kind of rare. They haven't really restocked them. So those are the reasons why they cost so much. But I got mine for a pretty good deal. And um, yeah, this figure is insanely cool. 
So there's what Raven looks like from the front. I love the character designs for Gravity Rush of Raven and Cat. All right, and then we have the three different faces for Raven. So you get four faces in total, one with a mask, one with the mouth open, one looking a different direction. So that is some nice variation there. You also get some hands. So here are some hands that also come with it. And it's nice having this because it keeps them all together. So that's great. And then also you get the crow. So there's the crow. Very shiny and kind of starry on the inside. All right, so now let's take a closer look at Raven the Figma figure from Gravity Rush 2. So, I absolutely love her design. I think it looks insanely cool with the black and the red hair that's like flowing in the wind and everything. She has such a cool outfit. All right, so there's the, the crow on her arm. So that looks very nice. And um, yeah, let's check out the articulation on this figure. Super easy to bend. Super easy to articulate and whatnot. You can move the head, arm, legs, everything. So there she doing a karate kick. Very cool. And overall, I'm really impressed with this figure. I love the Gravity Rush video game series. It's definitely a hidden gem series for sure. And uh, I can't wait to make some more videos with Raven through stop motion animation. So, yeah, all good stuff there. So, basically how you um, switch out the face, you take this off, and then take the face off and then you pick one. So we'll do this face where she's like yelling, where she's like fighting. And it's easy just like that. So yeah, this figure looks fantastic. It definitely gets a thumbs up from me. 10 out of 10 figure. It's insanely cool. The design, the colors, the articulation, it's all so good. So yeah, it's just super easy to articulate. Comes with a way to like clamp onto a table and have it like, like she's floating in the air, so to speak. And I think that's awesome. I absolutely love this figure of Raven. Um, I'm gonna get Cat next. I already have it ordered. And it's coming from like China or Japan, I believe. So it'll be a little while before it gets here, but I'm glad that I got Raven here brand new. In fact, I got both of them brand new, both Raven and Cat. I think it's cool how it comes with her animal of choice that gives her the gravity powers. That's really awesome. Also, yeah, I just have nothing but good things to say about all of this stuff that comes with the, the figure, you know. The hands, a bag to keep it all in, a stand clip to make her float, multiple faces that are easy to switch in and out. The crow and everything. So yeah, hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did enjoy the video, leave it a like, subscribe if you're new, and until next time, peace out.